Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm back with some more Nuzlocking adventures. Very calm. Alright, let's go in. So, as you remembered last time, we did in fact lose a good, good, good buddy. Um, as Raiders fan has decided, uh, in the deep lore of the, the, the universe, um, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Johan, who was a shiny red Gyarados was actually the son of Dom, and uh, we keep calling it the fish, but it's the the Magikarp who I cannot remember the name of, so I'm gonna go in here and remember what the hell her name is. Let me go in here. It is... Where are you? No, withdraw. Fansa. There you go. The love child of them, uh, after I threatened the old people that I would not accept any child from their birth, the, I guess he ended up in the Lake of Rage. They tossed the egg, they actually yeeted the, the egg so far across the ocean that it landed in the Lake of Rage. And he was born, he cracked open, but he was born angry. Later on was reunited with his father Dom, and then died in, uh died in order to sac sacrifice his life for his father. There you go. And that's the deep lore. Sad deep lore, too. We got it! We have all eight gems, everyone! So what happens now? Well, the answer is go to New Bark Town and fly the hell out of here. But here's also what we're going to do. We're going to go to, I think, Goldenrod City. Because there's someone I need to fight. <clears throat> um, and then from there, we're going to start build into the end game and by end game I mean elite four uh, are we gonna be able to beat the elite four good question I don't know oh she didn't want me do you want me sir Boo. okay I forget who here wants me maybe it was up here let me find out who wants me you want me no I know it's a girl. <sighs> Screw it. Alright, so... First things first. We're gonna go to Eurotech City. We're gonna do something that we haven't done at all yet, which is free... Uh, the... I was gonna call them the Dynamic Dudes, but that's not what they're called. The, uh, <laughs> the Legendary Dogs. Who here can rock smash? I'm being honest, I don't want to teach any one of you rock smash. So it's time to bring someone- <gasps> I know who we can teach rock smash. You love him. You- He was there at the very beginning. Helping out everyone. If you can guess. Right now, in the comments, tell me before I pick up who is about to learn rock smash. And also... Well, we'll just figure it out. And the answer is, of course... Dun, 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 dun. Mouse! Hello, Mouse. Mouse, please be able to learn Rock Smash. Rock Smash. Yeah, Mouse! There's a stupid flyer in here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hmm. I mean, all these moves are very good. I forgot I taught you Mudslap. Oh, let's get rid of Quick Attack. You're not really going to be fighting anymore, Mouse. Let's be real with it. But what you can be doing... I mean, worst case scenario... Uh, I mean, even if it did come to worst case scenario, you're not one of the reserve members I would pick just simply because you're so squishy. Such a squishy... Oh! Did I catch anything in here? I don't remember. So I'm gonna say no. Dom, you're too strong right now. I need you to back off this rat. Alright. Rock smash. Oh, I'm about to completely rock these dudes' world. Ah, oh, I should train Jolene while I have the chance. Damn it. Alright, I'm gonna go back. Ugh. Uh, this is the most annoying part of anything. Doom 
Oh boy. Hmm. Deposit. This is what like old Pokemons were like, man. Hmm. I just like making that noise. It's something me and my brother do a whole bunch. And when we see a specific face, we call it the hmm. Like like look at Whooper. Hmm. It's a very specific face. Jolene, come out. You have to, it's it, like, not everyone can do the face. For example, it doesn't work with everyone. Watch. Hmm. See, like, it doesn't work. He's too grouchy. Hmm. See, it works perfect. Hmm. See, no, too serious. See, too serious. Too serious. Yep, doesn't work. Does not work at all. That's my professional opinion on that. Uh, let me take away that move of yours. No, it was King's Rock. Who had EXP share? No one had EXP share, that's right. At least I sure hope no one had EXP share on. This is, this is where we learned Johan had the EXP share and he took it with him to his grave. Cause that would really suck. Who has the EXP share? Who here has EXP share? Am I losing my damn mind? Oh, it's a Raiders fan. Oh boy. <laughs> Raiders fan, where are you? Can you just give me the item? Huh. Damn it. This is Box Simulator 2020. Putting Dom. I really don't need Dom for this next part. There you are. See? Krabby doesn't have a mm, face either. It's very specific what kind of people can have the mm, face. Take. Take in, take in, take. Now I give. Jolene, take the CXP share. Yes! Jesus Christ, man. Can we get... Move on. We've been doing this for almost eight minutes and nothing has happened. To be fair, that's... It's these games. I love them. But early on, this is what they were. See, back in my day, kids, we didn't have the advantages of a constantly moving PC box like you do nowadays. In my day, you had to work um, tooth and nail in order to actually get um, anything done. Everything had to be a process. And believe it or not, you know what? As, as, <laughs> oh, hello. Fire breaver dick. <laughs> Fire breather dick. Oh. There's no way in hell that this stupid dick can actually kill my Jolene. So, way ain't even gonna front. We're about to set this man's entire life on fire, aka his dick. Jolene, leveled up. Good girl. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think that was a good idea. Fire breather, dick. I burned down to white ash, my dick. Fire breather, dick here. Here to tell you. I'm on fire. Ah, oh, damn it, that was a waste of uh, picking up anything. Boo! Okay. <laughs> Let me quickly get on my bike. Alright. Now, I believe in Crystal, you actually get a chance to catch Suika. But in this game, I don't know why they did this. Because it sucks ass. They're like, you know those three legendaries everyone loved? What if we made their location random and you couldn't ever find them? It was the most annoying shit ever. I hate it. That's the one thing I think is a negative in this game is the fact that they, that's the legendaries. It sucks so much. Oh, hello, coughing. I already caught you, so it doesn't matter. It's so annoying. Like, who likes that shit? No one. Who likes the ability to actually... I can understand if the Pokemon's like, um... Like, it's different. Like, legendaries, I feel like, shouldn't be random where you find them. They should always be exactly where you want them to be. Ah, <sighs> man. 
Maybe I'm crazy on this one. Maybe I'm in the minority on this, but I never thought that was fun. As a kid, I thought it was just annoying. And then as the games went on, it got, you know what was cool? Every Pokemon having its own set location, being super bitchin' and awesome. And to be fair, I think later games eventually gave you the best of both worlds, because the um, Ruby and Sapphire did have all the three Reggies, which aren't the greatest legendaries in the world, but they do exist. And then um, they had um, Latias and Latios. Um, and then the next game, you had the fucking Me Sprit and I forget the name of the other two, honestly. Fire Breather Ned. Um, I don't know. It's a waste of time. Long story short, waste of time. Artificially lengthens the game. That doesn't need to be longer. Are you gonna blow up on me, Coffin? No? Okay. Because I was about to say. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, growl. Does does Growlithe have an mmm face? No. I think it's more like playful. It's too playful, actually, because you can see that even though he is in the face of a smile, it's more like of an ooh smile. I think. Doesn't make the cut. I don't make the rules here. Coughing. Does coughing has an? Does he have an mmm face? Let me look at just coughing. Mmm. Yeah, he does. He totally does. Mmm. Who are you gonna cut me? Mmm. Wonder how much of that <laughs> is being picked up on the bike. Oh man, I'm surprised anyone watches this still. I'm over 60 episodes deep, and I'm talking about. Weird inside jokes I have with my brother. Still not hot enough. It's burning. Fire burning on the dance floor. Who here remembers Sean Kingston? The most... You know what? Sean Kingston was ahead of its time. Let me tell you why. I think he makes... He's made two of the most... Is it really two of the most? Um... I think he's made at least one or two of the greatest... Uh, no, he's made two at least. Uh, two of the greatest Sim songs ever created. Because think about the, you know, I know what you're saying. Like, oh, what makes a Sim song different from um, a regular love song? Here's my answer. Look at Sean Kingston. Boom. Now, nothing against the man. I'm sure he can pull up perfectly fine, ladies or men, depending on what he wants. I'm not 100% sure. But, just, like, obviously, he needs help. He was, he lost a bunch of girls to, like, uh, age 14 Justin Bieber in his song Eeny Meeny Miny Moe Lover which I'm not gonna repeat the name of that song you should see the music video for it though <laughs> if anything I'm saying um, but yeah listen to it the, the, the two songs are Burnin' which is somebody called 911 so boom Sean Kingston is already committing a crime and he's saying shoddy burning burning hot on the dance floor which at that point is a waste of everyone's time including the police it's like sir please did you really just call us here because this girl was very attractive? And he would go, yeah. And that's bad. And then the other one is, of course, Beautiful Girls, where he says, a girl is so beautiful he wishes to kill himself. So, like I said, ahead of his time, two of the great simp ballads, just nothing but appreciating the woman. Now, for example, Neo, not a simp. The reason why? Find out next episode. I'm going to come back to this a day later and then I'm going to have to remember why Dio isn't a sim. It's going to be very unfortunate. Alright everyone, that's the end of today's episode. I just wanted to let the dogs out. Boom!